Hello there, Robbie Guy here, and today we're gonna be opening up these premium collection boxes. Um, these little milk cartons are cram packed with good Pokemon packs and sleeves and deck boxes and all that good stuff with the respective promo cards for both Cyrus and Clara. So well, let's jump on in and let's see how we do. Let's go. Alrighty, we have the boxes here deconstructed. You can see they each have their own respective dice for uh, the Cyrus and Clara boxes. The sleeves for each, both with the great artwork there from the side of the box. With those off to the side as well. And then we have the promo cards for both. Very stunning, we'll keep those up there. The tokens for both. Not, you know, trading card game legal or anything, but still cool to have. And then the deck boxes look really cool. And these are where the packs are gonna be located. So um, we'll see the pack selection. It looks like there's actually a, quite a bit in here. So this should be interesting. And uh, we get the status tokens in here as well. Um, very cool. That's what the inside the box looks like in case you're curious. We'll get both of these open here and ready to go. Very cool. We'll just have a lot of status coins and all that good stuff. Ready to go. And then this one actually doesn't have an interior artwork, which is very interesting compared to um, the Clara box. But super cool, nonetheless, to see these deck boxes becoming uh, more and more common in the uh, trading card uh i don't know like the, the giveaways they have with these boxes and like what they're putting out there as pokemon product it seems to be a lot cooler and i appreciate that for sure and then here we are with our packs we got silver tempest a lot of the silver tempest some astral radiance brilliant stars and fusion strike um a lot of good a lot of good pack variety here. Um, big Astral Radiance fan, Brilliant Stars, and Fusion Strike. Um, all good uh, packs as well. Um, we're going to kind of go in that order. I like to open them in order. Let's see here. They do kind of just cram them in there. And I do appreciate um, them not wasting as much uh, um, putting these packs together. This seems like a very light pack. I feel like we got nothing out of this pack. How many cards were in that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There was eight cards in that pack. I don't know what that's about. <laughs> that's so funny. That pack felt so light. Oh man, okay. Shorted two cards from that pack, not a big deal. Still got the rare, got the reverse. Go into our next Fusion Strike pack. That's kind of like how my luck's been with Fusion Strike. I've had the worst luck. Um, with pulling anything from this set. Um, I pulled the same UV probably countless times, but no alternate arts, no secret rares, nothing cool. Um, but we'll go into Brilliant Stars, moving right along. That little Carablast there, code card. I always give away the code cards, so make sure you hit the bell icon if you want to be one of the first viewers to have a chance to get these code cards locked in. Uh, Corpfish, Clang, and Haxorus for the rare. Um, we'll keep on going with our next Brilliant Stars pack. Oh, hit the stand there, not a big deal. There's that Clank code card, enjoy. We got ourselves Water Energy, Cleaning Gloves, Dust Clops, Bear Tick, Clank, Spirit Tomb, Axew, Impidimp, Magmar, hit my top, going into that employee on. Um, super cool. Astral Radiance will be our next pack. And this has been a set we've had some pretty good success with. Code card, enjoy. Got Dark Energy, Duwa, Yamega, Selene, Heracross, Teddy Ursa, Mantine, Scyther, Basculin. And there is that Galarian Mr. Mime. And these cards were sticking together. And there was that Secret Rare uh, Shadow Rider Calyrex VMAX in the back there. Um, we will get sleeves on those for sure. Um, love seeing those pulls from Astral Radiance. Let's get that into place there. 
Alrighty, we'll go into our Astral Radiance pack for some more um, pulls, hopefully. Code card, enjoy. Um, Astral Radiance is a set I really enjoy from the Sword and Shield era. Um, we got a Cricket Tune, Unidentified Fossil, Bronzong, Drifloon, Heracross, Teddy Ursa, Mantine, Cilian Voltorb, Koalaba, going into that Reggie Rock. Um, just, I just think the artworks from Astral Radiance are super nice. Um, a lot of great cards to chase from the set. Um, the gallery cards are great. Honestly, I think this is one of the better sets. Um, let me know what you think one of the better sets are from the Sword and Shield era. Uh, Dark, Bronzong, Roxanne, Curlia, Krakatot, Stantler, Quillfish, Scyther, Tokopi, the Ursaluna going into the mill tank, um, which has its niche in the... Um, I've seen a niche in some of the local tournaments that we play in here, um, for sure. Just gives you a chance to reset pace a little bit. Code card. Here we go. Stone Fighting Energy per Ugly, Azelf, Switch Cart, Chat Top, Magnemite, Teddy Ursa, Suing Sneasel, Mistrivious, Mantine going into that Rapidash. And then we're going into a big bulk of the Silver Tempest, which we haven't really had a chance to open that much on the channel. So I'm super excited to dive into that. Let's get our Silver Tempest pack going here. Code card. Got that Psychic Energy, Anorith, Matang, Draclok, Fungus, Elegem, Zubat, Solosis, Krogunk, uh, Fursoed Girl, and Cobalion. Um, very cool. I just think the later sets in Sword Shield were a lot better. Um, I think they, the Pokemon Company knew what they were doing, for sure, um, when putting these sets out. Uh, we got that Metal Energy, Dragonair, Torcat, V-Guard Energy, Pharaoh Seed, Chin Chow, Petlil. I never really noticed the artwork there. Very great. Uh, Litten, Smeargle, Elegym, and going to the Verizian. Are we going to get um, all three of those guys in one shot here? That'd be pretty cool. Keep it going. Hopefully we get some good pulls. From Silver Tempest, that Lugia was really nice. Haven't pulled one of those yet. Uh, Candice, Glalie, Unidentified Fossil, Petlil, Tukatamaru, Halucha, Relicanth, Sandy Gast, Fungus, going into that Amistar V. Um, very cool. Get a sleeve on that Amistar. Very nice. And it's so funny. We like um, I just opened up that Scarlet and Violet set. And they're doing away with the V's and the V Maxes. So it's kind of interesting to see that going away. And like the yellow border is going away um, from uh, English printed Pokemon cards. It's just something I haven't gotten used to. And like jumping back into this, it, it's so weird to me. But um, I'm glad we're having some success with our packs here. Um, Draclok, Matang, Anorith, Drowsy, Spinarak, Routes, Krogunk, Solosis. The Radiant Sarina, and I think we've pulled all the Radiants. Ooh, I take that back. I think we're still looking for that Radiant Gardevoir. Um, but we've pulled a lot of the Radiants um, that we've been looking for. So Radiant Sarina to the collection. Very nice. And we got two more packs here. And uh, hopefully we can keep our luck going just a little bit longer. Uh, there's the code card. We got ourselves a dark energy, a lot of dark energies in this pack. <laughs> Behem, Emergency Jelly, Fennekin, Murkrow, Beldum, Baltoy, Sunkern, Zubat, going into the Hisuian Legate um, for the rare. And we're going to come down to the last pack magic here. Hopefully we get lucky. Hopefully we get some pulls. Um, no pressure. Um, white code card, probably not. But... <laughs> You never know. It could happen. It could be this pack. Uh, we got the Water Energy, Glalie, Candice, Behem, Litten, Murkrow, Swablu, Rotom, Baneri, Rufflet, going into a Frostlass um, to close today's pack opening. But we did have some pretty great pulls, and uh, I did sleep uh, Boss's orders and that Clara 
um, just for the sake of the video so we can look at the polls we had. Um, here is that Amistar V, the Radiant Star Arena, the Shadow Rider Calyrex of VMAX, uh, gold, secret rare, uh, Glaring Mr. Rhyme V, uh, Boss's Orders, and the Clara Promo. Um, all stunning cards. Glad we were able to open these, and I, I'm still can't get over the fact that how great these deck boxes look. Um, I'm definitely going to be using these just because uh, it'll make me look super cool when I play in my local tournaments. But I just want to say thank you guys for watching. Please leave a like, leave a comment. Let me know what your favorite card was from today's opening. I think mine's going to have to be the boss's orders with Cyrus there. Um, just an iconic leader for sure. And just an absolute madman. So, um, And hit that subscribe button and hit the bell icon if you want to be notified every time we upload on the channel here. And uh, thanks for watching. And we'll see you next weekend. Thanks. Bye.